A Nobel Prize winner graced the halls of WBZ today. Dr. William Kalin talked to our Paula Eben about his research on cells and how it will help in the fight against breast cancer. This all comes ahead of the Breast Cancer Research Foundation's Hot Pink Luncheon this Friday in the city, which helps fund the research. And WBZ is a proud media sponsor of that event. Dr. William Kalin is a professor of medicine and researcher at Dana-Farber Cancer Institute, Brigham and Women's Hospital in Boston, and a professor at Harvard Medical School. And we must say congratulations. He is the latest winner of the Nobel Prize for Medicine earlier this month. Congratulations. Great. Thank you very much. It must have been an amazing phone call. It was life-altering, as you can imagine. Uh, First of all, it comes, as you may have heard, very early in the morning. Mm -hmm. So it was a 4.40 a.m. Uh, phone call, so half asleep. I could see that uh, I had a incoming call with uh, many, many, many digits. It <laughs> looked like it was from Stockholm, so my heart started racing. Oh. And then I got a very nice voice at the other end telling me I had won the Nobel Prize. And, uh, medicine and at that point the, the emotions were just overwhelming amazing and we we see you wearing your pink here you have been a longtime partner funded by the breast cancer research foundation and i know that you've said that their support has led to all of your work how yeah. important is bcrf to you yes so ironically when we began doing the work that led to the nobel prize it was initially focused on some other cancers, not mm. breast cancer, and I happened to be in Stockholm where I met Larry Norton from the BCRF and we had dinner together and I said, you know, I think there's an opportunity to apply what we've learned in these other cancers and now use it to try to tackle mm -hmm. breast cancer. And uh, if I had been trying to apply for federal funding at the time, people would have said, well, he has no track record sure. in breast cancer. What, why take a chance on him? Mm -hmm. But Larry said, send me a proposal and, and the BCRF will take a look at it. And within three months, we had funding and we were doing experiments and they've supported me ever since. And that's really what BCRF does, right? The money cuts through the red tape and gets right to researchers like yourself. Uh, and that has had a huge impact on breast cancer treatment. Absolutely. For an organization like the BCRF, it's so critical to, first of all, have people uh, with scientific tastes who can help identify the right opportunities and the right scientists, but secondly, are willing to take a, a long view. Uh, understanding you can't always predict uh, what direction science is going to take mm. you, you, but you you know you have to have a nose for the best scientific opportunities and the best scientists to fund. Uh, and I'm so thankful they took a chance uh, in me, and I'm so happy that I can now help share this prize with them. And I know this is personal for you as well. Your late wife, Dr. Carolyn Kalin, was a driving yes. force for the fall luncheon for yes. BCRF, which will take place this week in Boston. Yes. And uh, she passed away and. Uh, this connection has always been so meaningful. Yes, that's the other reason why I was so thankful to be supported by BCRF because, as you said, my, my wife had devoted her entire career to breast cancer care and was so devoted to her uh, patients that to have the opportunity to now take some of the things we learned and to apply them directly to breast cancer couldn't have been more meaningful. And at this luncheon, it's wonderful that so many doctors are interviewed and they present their latest findings and the ways in which BCRF and that funding has helped them directly help patients. Yes, um, the, the BCRF has clearly emerged as the premier funder for breast cancer mm -hmm. Uh, research around the world. Uh, as you know, they now support hundreds of investigators around the world. Uh, and so there's real critical mass. And the scientific symposia that they sponsor are just electric because you never know where the next great idea is going to come from. Incredible. And if you'd like to donate, of course, you can go to bcrf.org. Dr. William Kalin, thank you so much and congratulations. Thank you very much.